Hello everyone, you might have noticed the new confection prize box in Spiral Knights. Usual prize box prices apply, and there's a few new goodies in here. It's mostly costumes, just chef hats and chef coats, but then there's a new shield, and a new gun. The shield's not very useful, but the gun, well, that's something else. It's unique, I'm not sure why they put a new gun type into a prize box, but they did. Shoots out these boomerang projectiles, they'll follow you and return to you, not where you shot it from. So you can use this to arc the shots around things like Mecha Knight shields or Trojan shields. It's a very neat concept. So each of these shots fires out two bullets, and each of those bullets does as much as a Storm Driver would, or a close range Polaris shot would. That means that you get an extreme amount of close single range target or single target DPS. Compare one of these. Fired twice and killed two enemies to a Polaris. Fire twice. Kill this one thing because I'm at close range. Does way more single target than a Polaris, but less against groups. The Volt Driver used to be useful for swapping with the Polaris. You just Alk swap like normal and get a ton of DPS increase. Now that's obsolete because this Mixmaster does a lot more damage than a Voltec ever could. It has a slightly lower range than a Polaris or Volt, or a Polaris or Storm Driver, but that's not too big of a problem because the projectiles stay out longer since they arc back as well. The charge attack fires out two larger waves of shots. They do about double the damage but it's not that useful because their range is lower than the normal shot, and because the charge attack makes you a bit more vulnerable. And the weapon's very useful for kiting, so using the charge just gets that weakness... or gets the weakness of making you vulnerable added on. Not very worth it. Now, this thing is glitched. It came out in a really weird state, obviously not tested much. At first it was doing normal damage instead of elemental, and it can also shoot through walls, so that's a problem. Let's you clear a lot of things like Vanaduke and Shadow Lair extremely easily because you can just skip areas or kill enemies before you're supposed to be able to. Um, right now the gun's going for about a mil. You have a 5% chance of getting it from a confection box, so I'd recommend just flat out buying the gun if you want one, rather than risking the box. Um, yeah, this thing... It's definitely overpowered right now. It's a bit too strong. It's not too overpowered if they get rid of the shooting through walls thing, but they'll still need to reduce the range a little bit more just to make its weaknesses a bit more obvious. So yeah, that's the overcharged Mixmaster for you. Um, let me know if I let, left anything out and uh, if you're planning on getting one of these for yourself. Hopefully they release versions that don't require a prize box, even if it's not the same shock and elemental thing. It'd still be nice to have the gun as an option for everyone, not just paying players. With that said though, I'm out for now, so have a good one.